as I said, there are some challenges, particularly with retaining people, and that's got a lot to do with career selection. Reality TV is an absolute disaster for young people. I mean, they watch MasterChef or something like this and think, gee, this is what it's all about. But it is actually, there is still peeling of potatoes and, and different things in, in the kitchen. Why have I put up a definition of what an apprenticeship is? This really gets back to a presentation I gave in Singapore about three years ago. And I honestly thought I nailed it. There was a lot of people who did not speak English as a first language, so I slowed it down, and I'm sorry if I'm speaking quick tonight, but I'm pretty excited to be here. I thought, Nick, this has been a good presentation. It was simple. I got to the end, and I said, are there any questions? And a lady put up her hand in the third row. Question, excellent. Question straight off the bat. And the organisers smiled and, and were like, this is great. And she said, uh, so uh, how long have you uh, worked for Donald Trump? And I like step backwards and I'm like, Donald, what Donald? Oh, God. The Apprentice, the television show. <laughs> so I had talked for 45 minutes and I had not explained what an apprenticeship is. And I gather half the room thought it had something to do with reality television. So it's, it's really important to understand what an apprenticeship is. So that's my definition and I'm sure there's different definitions. But it really needs to be this idea of an accredited program and it really is about mastering an occupation. But there are some new and innovative apprenticeships always coming online, and I think the definition of apprenticeship is constantly being reviewed.